Yo what's up Kempsey here and today I'm bringing you another tutorial and basically I know I told you that I'm gonna upload the top 5 places from my contest but actually I just remembered that there is a stupid new TGN rule which don't allows me to upload any music to my channel even if it's uncopyrighted I need to um, have official permission of the artist which is really silly because um, if it's uncopyrighted you just can't use it um, that's just how I got told all the time and now it should be different so um, I don't get that rule anyway um, um, I contacted the artists of the songs you used in your top 5 speed and I actually hope that they will get back to me really soon um, that I can upload your speeders but I'm actually also um, talking to Machinima about a partnership probably this is working um, and yeah so um, I'll just let you know when I'm uploading this so in today's tutorial I'm just gonna show you how you can uh, or I'm just giving you some tips for the pen tool and actually um, first of all I'm gonna show you how you can make um, I'm just starting with the basics of the pen tool actually um, I'm just gonna show you how you can make a horizontal line let's just click here and then hold down shift and just click here and it's horizontal um, if you just click there like and think oh yeah that's horizontal it will it probably will come like this so that's um, pretty easy and pretty useful to just hold down shift and just click here so it's horizontal. Um, same thing, oops, just make it back. Same thing when you hold shift and click on the top or somewhere, it's gonna be vertical. So that's really useful and a lot of people probably don't know about this um, because they ask me how I got my lines so horizontal or that stuff. Um, and they always think like I have monster eyes or something but no um, it's just the shift button which makes it really easy um, this is probably just for beginners everyone who designed for a bit knows this um, but yeah I'm also here for beginners so now I'm gonna show you how I can make a, a, a line which goes up in 45 grades like this it's just pretty much exactly the same again just hold down shift and click somewhere here in the middle like if you are here it's gonna be horizontal and if you're here it's already gonna be 45 great um, you just need to to um, play around with it and just um, get used to it then you will know where it's gonna be horizontal where it's gonna be vertical and where it's gonna be 45 great um, so there are actually the three things you can go 45 grade horizontal and vertical and what I'm going to do now is basically how you can um, make like a letter with the pen tool um, I'm actually just gonna try making just an I don't know an N or something just like this so I'm always gonna use like guidelines when I use the pen tool if you make a logo or something, um, just use a lot of guidelines. It's gonna help you a lot. Okay, just make some more here. Um, like at the end of a logo, if I make one with the pen tool, I have like I don't know, probably about fifty. Um, oh wow, I just forgot something. Probably about fifty guidelines or something I really use a lot of them just go back here uh, I'm not gonna make it like that perfect at the moment um, because uh, I'm just gonna make this really quick so not just somewhere there yeah it looks looks kinda crap now <laughs> I know um, but it's just here to show you now so that's basically my N and now um, make a new layer because you want to fill it, fill this out. Uh, choose color of black because our background is just white. Right click and fill path, foreground color and click OK. Delete path and there's actually our M. 
So um, that's just the basics of uh, the pen tool. I hope it helped you out a bit. Um, next tutorial or next pen tool tutorial. This was part one. I'm gonna do part two. Um, there I'll be showing you how you can make a um pen tool logo, like the completely logo, not just basics. Um, I'm gonna show you how you can make a whole logo like my CamC text or like Reddit text actually. He made a tutorial about it as well. Um, but you guys are asking me since a long time so I, I think I'm gonna make it. Just uh, leave a comment or PM me with your tutorial successions. Um, if you don't wanna see the pen tool tutorial, the pen tool logo tutorial anymore because Rated already did it, um, just tell me. I don't wanna copy him or anything with his tutorials. Um, I just want to help you guys out. I want to get you your skills better. I want to improve your skills or I want to help you improving your skills. Um, and I actually think you can improve your skills by just watching um, my tutorials or you can improve your basic skills. Um, also probably um, I hope in the next two three weeks or in the next two weeks um, I can upload the the contest top five places. I really hope that. I'm not sure about it yet, but I think it should be makeable. Um, and yeah, another thing you can do with the pen tool is actually click here, um, and then for example click here, and then just drag it out. That's another part of the tutorial. Yep, like so. Um, you actually just see um, that's perfect curve. You know what I mean? You can also make it like this if you don't want to have a perfect curve, or in the other on the other side. And now, um, actually, you you dragged that path a bit out. Um, if you just click here now, you see there's already another curve. Um, that's not that what we actually want to have. So, we just, or if you want to have it, it's okay. You can keep it like that. But there's a way to get like their straight line there. So, just press Alt, click that uh, point here, and then it actually removes like that path and it resets the path. So, you just can add a straight line. Or so, however, you actually want to do that. Um, it's pretty much up to you what you want to use. That was just another basic tip. Um, oh, okay. Um, also, uh, you could make a circle in this way by holding Shift down, but there's no point because you can simply make a circle with this tool. Just hold down Shift as well. I know Shift is important uh, button for graphic designers. So just hold shift down and it's actually gonna be a perfect circle. Right click there and make um where is it? Make work path. And you go to the pen tool and you can fill it out or something with foreground color, whatever. Delete the path. Um that's just uh, some basic skills which are not too advanced now. Um and for really um for a designer who already designs for a bit, um, that's nothing new or not that new. Or what you can do as well. I just made a little mistake. I just like forgot to make a new um, layer when I just made that circle. Like go back he here. Um, if you have your circle now. On a new layer, just fill it out. Delete the path. You can now cut out a selection of it, like put a pen tool on here, and then just uh... okay. My screen's too small for this, so I need to zoom out a bit. Actually, no, my screen's really big, but not for this. Um, if you want to make a moon like something, you can go here and just uh, make it like this. And I'll just 
go on make selection go on the selection tool just click delete and you actually have like a moon like this is more yeah um, that's not a moon that's more just a black thing in Photoshop but yeah, anyway um, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial I hope it helped you out a bit if you are a beginner actually um, this was part one of the pen tool tutorial series if you want to have more of this just leave a like um, I mean leave a comment also leave a like if you want um, but just leave a comment s telling me that you want to see more pen tool tutorials um, there that were just the basics like pretty much the pen tool is the most or one of the most like if you want to be really really creative you use the pen tool a lot it's gonna be a really really creative um, tool if I can say that um, like if you make something from scratch you always use the pen tool um, and it's one of the most important tools in Photoshop um, so it's really really good if you have some basic skills and in the next tutorials I'm gonna show you how you can improve those basic skills um, I don't know if it's gonna be the next tutorial because I won't have that much time in the next few days because I got my last exams but um, I'm gonna make another tutorial this week for sure probably not with the pen tool but we will see that so I hope I'll see you soon. Um, I hope you like this. Um, if it helped you out, please leave a like and a comment, and also go to uh, go and subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. Um, yeah, I'm out. Peace.